good early morning. Well, it's not too early. We daily vlog. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog. So if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you come back every day. Look at the like. I'm gonna walk from the bed to the living room because Eve woke me up to bring her outside this morning, and the sun is 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 basically risen. But look at this, just what we woke up to. Look at that Christmas tree. Winter Wonderland. <laughs> it is, I don't know if I've ever been in a snowed, foresty kind of area. I mean, come on. Come on. I wonder if I have any uh, juice in the drone, because I know I needed to charge them. I think one of them might be good. Okay, there is. But first, we need a fire. Gonna make sure this catches, and then we will be good. This is truly like all I wanted in the cabin is this. Oh, good morning, you two. I've been awake for just an hour. Oh, have you? I'm not joking. So you guys know our bedroom is like blacked out. So all right, these at home. At home. Mm -hmm. So like all the windows and natural light coming in and the snow reflecting. I like stirred because of Eve, and then we all woke up. <laughs> all right, everybody's outside just for a little walk just to see, because I need to show. I wish I had the drone out now. <laughs> but the batteries are charging, they were toast after that little flight because I didn't plan it. <laughs> Eve, let's see if she goes in the mound. Last night, she just dove right in. Oh, there she goes. So the owner came by with his tractor, <laughs> his tractor plow and did this. And you can see people are flying on the road. Our car's two miles down that road. And then another, look at, see, just, look at how gorgeous those trees are with the yeah. sun. Can you imagine if it was like that last night? Uh, <laughs> Give you this way. I think she has her winter coat on. <laughs> yeah. So this is the cabin during the day. Creekside, welcome to Creekside Cabin. Um, there's like a patio out there. Obviously, we're not going to be using it right now. There's like a two feet of snow on it. You can see, look at. Oh my gosh, look at the sun breaking above it. The what? snow, the smoke coming out from the stack, from the fire we lit. <sighs> we're chilly. <laughs> We just came out to go real quick. I like this is the perfect snow to build a snowman. I just don't think we actually brought the proper attire for Sarah and myself. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh! 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 <laughs> that was the greatest. Are you, you done? Yeah. You done with the outside? <laughs> Sarah takes nature in sections. Oh. Look at that. Look at that, that's, ugh. 
So that is where the car was on this beautiful but desolate road, but we got it out. So I'm gonna head back, get unpacked finally. Woo. I have to say, it's still absolutely gorgeous though. I mean, look at this. So this is like the downhill up, but we would have had to battle. I didn't realize, look how far of a drop that is if we, if the car like spun off and fin, like went off the side of the road. Like that is a significant drop. We were literally 4.2 miles away from the cabin from where the car was. Very, very close. Okay, I don't know if you can see her. She's kind of blending in. But Evie's like found her spot. Is that the perfect size for you? All right, we're kind of in our groove now. We had a snack. James is watching Trolls. I just love this tree. Eve's going upstairs because Sarah's editing. I love that window. Got the fun. I've got like, I got it down. I got this. I got this down. Look at that. Yes. I literally might leave this place wanting to buy a cabin because this, I watched Trout and Coffee, a YouTube channel. Definitely check it out. Um, we'll link it down below. But everything about like, shoot, where do they live? The Berkshires are all about like these little stuff, like fire stoves. But this is the goal. Like, this is what I wanted, just to, like, literally sit around these comfy couches in this cabin. I hoped there would snow. I would have gone, would have, oh, my God, look at it, because it's windy. All the snow falling off the trees. That's gorgeous. I could have gone without getting the car stuck, but, hey, if it's the trade-off that we'll take for all this beautiful snow, I'm down. Really at all. Not anymore. I'm still coming up. I came downstairs. I edited upstairs um, because I don't. I, I can't find my headphones. I hid them from James and I hid them from myself. That's been happening a lot to me lately. <laughs> um, and James was falling asleep on Peter. And Evie's also resting. I'm so sorry. That side eye is real. Were you doing some reading? <laughs> We wanted to go to Concord House. We almost said we looked up, it would have been like a whole day's drive. <laughs> like we didn't have one yesterday. <laughs> Which is funny. We would have gone for like three hours to Concord House and then we probably would have spent a night in Boston or New York City then driven back. Um, All right, what do you think? Hmm? 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 All right, so I just took a shower. I feel like a human finally after the whole excavate of like driving here, snowstorm, car stuck, getting here late. The universe is giving me an early birthday present. What? Casey Nice that came out with another video. That's like two in a week. Now I know that's like has to do, I think, with him like promoting his like up and coming like monthly teaching class thing that he's doing. Mm -hmm. I don't care. I love Casey Nice Day videos. I thought it was gonna be like an actual gift. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Are you ready to play outside in the snow? <laughs> the golden mom, I have to get my my boots on and my jacket and I'm gonna grab the drone and Eve. <laughs> but we're gonna go see about, there's a sled, they, the, the hosts are also like left us a little sled to like drag them around in. Yeah, gotta get gloves and hat. Yeah. Hold on. I come outside to this. Where did my little baby go? Who is this cute kid? <laughs> We gotta put Evie in the sled. Who is this cute kid? Where'd my Whoa. little baby go? Yay! Evie, you love Evie loves this now. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy almost lost it. All right, let me set up this drone and uh, let's have some fun. Ooh! Ah! <laughs> Evie, run! <laughs>
Now that is a sign of a good wintery play. Shoes and pants drying by the wood stove. Little Women 90s version just ended. I might just throw it back to the, the new version now. Was that fun, guys? So fun. I think we all had fun, even Eve. Yeah. What James do you think, he James? Was, James was toasty. He was. He had all them layers on. <gasps> Thanks, Sarah, for this trip. Of course, thank you. Thank you for being bold. Hello, friends. Look at this puppy. She's just laying in front of this fireplace in the middle of this carpet. Um, um, it's been a little bit because when we came in from playing in all the snow, we all were hoping to take a nap. We gave James a bottle, and he wasn't feeling taking a nap. And then he got sick. He threw up, which is actually the second throw up in 24 hours. But we think he might, it might be related to like a sensitive stomach moment and his formula. We also got a formula that wasn't his regular, but like we've had this formula for a few days now. So we're just going to monitor it. He's happy. He doesn't feel achy or pain that we can tell. Um, his demeanor's the same. He's sleeping. He's drinking water. He's eating other food. Um, so we think like they may have just been like instances of like upset stomach. But we're going to monitor it. But anyway, I actually, he actually did fall asleep on me. And I fell asleep in the chair. And so now we're going to watch a little bit of New Girl. Might watch this new Sandra Bullock movie on Netflix. But I have to kick up the fire. That's kind of gone down. Going to eat some charcuterie. And I actually got rum. So I might just make me some fancy rum drinks. Or some cream soda. Because Sarah got me cream soda. Because I love. It's like a secret of like love of mine. Is IBC cream soda. Alright, we watched Unforgivable. You guys know. It was a heart. Peter doesn't like watching movies that have sad endings. He can endure sad movies as long as they don't have sad endings. The only spoiler we'll give, so skip 10 seconds if you want to hear it, is that it was almost a sad ending. Yes. It wasn't necessarily joyous, but it wasn't as terrible as we thought it was going to be. Yes. This baby has been asleep. I'm almost tempted to just like go to bed. Because I'm just nervous this isn't gonna last. And I'd rather. I don't know, what do you think? I don't think we do. I think when he wakes up, we make a bottle with the formula that we know he likes. Mm -hmm. He's almost been asleep for five hours. Oh man, he's gonna be up all night now. No, we won't. So this is very wilderness logic. The next thing we're doing. Look at this. It's a rag. Checkerboard it's just at Wilderness Lodge. Peter did beat me at checkers. And he also made this drawing on the chalkboard. I particularly like this one. <laughs> Peter's been making these smiley faces since as long as I've known him, and I love them with my whole heart. Beautiful Christmas tree. Taylor Swift, Netflix. Sleepy pup. And a sleepy mama and sleepy baby. And don't forget about my friends over here with the glasses. It is just about midnight. I don't. I think we have to transition to the bedroom. Like I don't want them to sleep on the couch. Um, but I'm gonna sign off because I think our night is pretty much kaput. It's 11:55. My birthday is in five minutes. I will be 30 years old. And you may think we drove through a snowstorm. It was supposed to be seven hours. Ended up being like 11, 12 to get here yesterday in the far northwest Wisconsin to sit on a couch with my wife and baby and dog and watch Netflix shows that we could have done at home, but this is what I wanted. I wanted nothing more uh, to celebrate my 30th birthday than to just sit here with my favorite people in the whole world, just all to ourselves um, in this cozy, cozy, cozy place. So I'm excited to get up in the morning we might go to this town that's an hour away. They have a Christmas village where we have to see. We might just sit around all day and watch Harry Potter movies or something. I'm not sure. I don't really care as long as I uh, have these three people with me. So it's good to be home. We know what our goals are. 
We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>